Hey there, Thermos Jar here, and let's talk about Arena Breakout Infinite. It's been on my radar for a while, and I was looking forward to it coming out, and I can play it and, you know, talk it officially about it. But I really want to bring out some factors that caught my eye, which I'm a bit afraid of, and at the same time, I kind of understand it. It's going to be hypocritical for me to even mention some of these things in a good light. So stay tuned, uh, like, subscribe, hate, whatever, just do whatever. But I'll appreciate that like and subscribe for sure, as well as dislike. So, Arena Breakout Infinite. Another Escape from Tarkov literally clone. Let me tell you a secret. I'm pretty sure the Chinese saw this thing and they're like, I fucking hate Tarkov. It's it's clunky, it's garbage, and whoever programmed it on Unity is a fucking monkey. So the Chinese took it, they made it better, they made it look better, they made it run better, they made every other aspect of the game better, and they're like, look what we have. We tested on mobile, it works there. Let's move it to PC. Let's take that player base. And you know that the best part? They will take the player base for a while. But there's a drawback. If they will take the player base. And they will succeed. With all those monetary things they're doing. Which is in-game cash. Hear me now. I'm slightly supporting that shit. Even though it's cancer. Why? It removes RMT. That means... There's not going to be third-party sellers of rubles or whatever the money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you think about it, it's going to get rid of that. So cheaters will have less incentive to farm in the game and make money. Cheats will be less prevalent. Well, they will be there, but it will be less likely to cheat for that. Because think about Tarkov. Tarkov is very fucking simple. Retarded people cheat... Well, not, they're not retarded. Okay, I'm gonna take my words. Those fuck motherfuckers who ruin your game, they only do it so that they can farm and progress other people, or vice versa, they're just, just making you feel horrible by cheating, or there's these people that are literally bad at the game, and without cheats, they cannot succeed in anything. So, it, it has this bunch of people, the uns unsuccessful morons that can't play the game properly will actually still be in breakout. They'll still get their cheats for that. But it will eliminate those people who are trying to boost. Oh no, they'll, they'll stay most likely. Uh, it's going to eliminate those people that are trying to RMT. Like get a lot of money in game, sell everything, and then slowly drip out the money to those who buy the money. And that's, I think, is the thing that will be removed. At least one type of cheater will be eliminated from the system. But that's only time will tell. Nevertheless, Arena Breakout is well-programmed game. Way more pro well-programmed than Escape from Tarkov. I played it and I would say it's... You don't need a decent PC. I played it on my shitty laptop. It worked. Steady 66 uh, frames per second. Uh, and I would say it was pretty good for it. Of course, the firefights would ed, uh, end up lagging a little bit, but but if you reduce the settings a little bit more, I could have easily played that game, which was a surprise. And the uh, connectivity issues were non-existent. Uh, sound is crisp. Gameplay smooth as butter. Yeah, headshots and death instantly go back to lobby was a thing. It was always a thing with these kind of games. But it wasn't... Oh yeah, I could fucking report people and, and see the kill cam. That was a big bonus, by the way. Yeah, man. That was a fresh air, to be honest. But be aware. Like, I'm, I am conflicted myself over this game. Do I recommend getting it? I'm playing it is since it's free to play. I would say try it out with your friends or alone. Just go for it. And when you make a decision, like I'm allowing you guys to make a decision. Don't listen to anybody except yourselves and how you feel playing the game. If you liked it, go for it. If you didn't like it, delete it and forget about it. So I don't want to rant too long about it. Let's come to conclusion. Arena Breakout Infinite. Conclusion is, try it out, play it, 
Don't go deep into all those controversies. Just try it out. Escape from Tarkov. What are you? You're a bad game with a great idea, with a horrible developers. I hope you one day get taken over by fans and they rip your code out and they just make a better game rather than just what we have right now. Uh, rest in peace, motherfucker. Stupid Tarkov. And yeah, that's about it. Have a nice day. See you in the next one. Hope the weekend's gonna be great.